Okay guys, so I'm gonna try to do it uh, handheld. Uh, my camera, although it's a pretty small camera, um, it's still pretty heavy, so I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try to make it quick. So this is where I'm at. I did pass the inspection and uh, I actually have uh, uh, Tesla tech coming over uh, tomorrow should be in here before lunch and uh, He's gonna program a key card for uh, for this Tesla and finally, I'm gonna be able to uh, Take it off the trailer. This was one of the main reasons why I decided to do this repair while the car is on the trailer simply because I had to uh, take it uh, for the pre-inspection then I had to uh, take it uh, to inspector for the final inspection then I was planning on uh, taking it to a Tesla dealer for a uh, key card programming so anyway there were a couple of things that I've done uh, late at night I actually realized that um, inspector is available like next day and uh, I had to act quickly and finish some repairs so it it would be ready for the inspection so i did change my um, driver side seat belt and uh, uh, anchor uh, what is it called anchor uh, pretensioner and uh, i also did uh, change the uh, knee airbag Now I need to get uh, SRS module, the airbag computer, uh, reset. So it's pretty simple to get the module out. You basically have to uh, take out only six uh, 10 millimeter bolts out, bolts out and you have to disconnect two electrical plugs. Okay, so this is the airbag com control module. Let's get it reset and put it back in. Okay guys, so we're all done with this uh, project. Um, I got the uh, SRS system completely uh, done. I got uh, airbags replaced, I got uh, seat belt replaced uh, and uh, module reset and it, it's back in. So I'm very excited for tomorrow. Tomorrow uh, this car is finally gonna touch the ground and uh, we'll, I'll take it for a short spin and uh, we'll, we'll go from there. <laughs>